Right then guys, Volvo V70R. Bit of an unusual colour, but it quite suits it to be fair. Um, looks nice from a distance. Um, as you get a little bit closer, there's the odd few imperfections. Um, just round the edge of this boot lid, a little bit of lacquer peel on there. Um, the roof has got, almost looks like, it looks almost like dust, but, um, but yeah, it's not, not terrible. Certainly not bad for a car of its age. A little bit around that back wing, that could probably be a couple of stone chips to be fair, being kicked up. Um, bonnet's nice, odd few stone chips, but what do you expect? Um, yeah, a few tiny little bit of scuffing chipping on that front lip. Um, but as a whole, paintwork isn't terrible. Um, wheels, however, are very nice. I would suspect they might have been refurbished, if not very well looked after. Um, nice grey colour. No marks on any of them. I don't take my word for it, but... No, I think they're all... Yeah, all the wheels are about perfect, I think. Just moving on to the inside. Sort of cream beige coloured interior. Door skins are nice. Door shuts, spot on really. Um, showing 76827 on there. So it's not a lot really, is it? Um, I have just driven it from just up there to pull it onto the front and it drove very nice, felt very solid. Starts on the key. Sounds lovely. Yeah, nice car inside really, passenger seat, not really anywhere at all, steering wheel, it's a little bit of like Alcantara on the top, a little bit rubbed away there, but to be fair, it's not that one, um, it's a little bit on the seat that I noticed as I got in, a little bit of a blemish on there, um, but yeah, not as bad as it could be, uh, around that back wheel latch is great, a few little marks on there, but Back seats, yeah. <laughs> Nothing really to mention as I'm in there. Just pop the back open because there is oh, that's heavy. <sighs> a spare wheel there, just sat on top. Um, and then just some sort of cover under there. I assume it'll be just a little bit of checker plating under there. But all looks very tidy. Show you again the other side. Exactly the same. This side. Yeah, it's always had mats in, so I would assume them carpets under there will be very good. I'll just come around here and pop the bonnet, unless it's. No, I thought I might have it open, but. Still this little lever down here. I can remember where the catch is on this, so he says, there we are, sound dead in under there, it's a big bonnet in it, but yeah, it's all intact under there, um, that Volvo five cylinder in there, lovely engine in it, they always sound good, um, I believe it drove in, don't take my word for it, but after driving it, I don't see any reason why it couldn't have done, um, yeah, very tidy car really, um, with them being the faster Volvos, I suppose. Um, so I suspect in a few years' time, it's probably going to be the one to have. Um, if you are interested, please do come and have a look. Paperwork will be upstairs as always. Thank you.